I'm going to be making easy family nachos using the ingredients I've got, including proper tortilla chips. First step then, let's get the oven preheated, 180 degrees Celsius, 160 fan bake. Uh, first ingredient, an onion. I've got quite a large onion. I'm just gonna use half, eking out ingredients, as I think most of us are, as we try to uh, cut down on supermarket trips. Just gonna fry off onion and the garlic. In it goes. And we'll give that a stir. We're gonna add in 500 grams of beef mince. In it goes. There we go. We're just gonna brown this through. Listen to that sizzle. In terms of seasoning, you might be lucky and have a packet of nacho or taco seasoning made up in your cupboard. I don't, so I've dug out all my bottles and spices and things here. I'm gonna make up my own. You can add basically a quarter teaspoon of anything, salt, pepper, chili powder, cumin, paprika even. I'm just gonna add a little bit more in here and that's gonna go into our mix. We're also gonna add a tin of tomatoes. If you don't have diced tomatoes like I do here, just chop up a whole tin. That's good, no problems. Kidney beans, I love adding these to bolognese and, and nachos. Carrot, and goes the kidney beans. There we go. Tomatoes going in. And finally, just gonna add those herbs and spices. In we go. Give it a stir around. This is gonna simmer for five minutes or so. It's been simmering away for about five minutes. Okay, this is ready to go. Let's get started on our tortilla chips. I'm using proper tortilla chips. I've got an oven-proof dish. I'm going to layer them in. These are straight from my kitchen cupboard. We love these chips. New Zealand made. We're gonna add our mince mixture on top of my proper tortilla chips. I'm gonna spoon this in. Got a cup full of grated cheese. I'm gonna be quite generous with this. On it goes. This is now ready to pop into the oven. Just gonna cook for a few minutes until the cheese is lovely and golden on top. It's gonna to make for a wonderful meal later. Here we go, easy family nachos. Serve them while they're hot with a dollop of sour cream. Oh, I'm gonna be generous with the sour cream. Yum, this looks good. Fresh parsley if you have some. I've got some in my garden. Also, if you've got fresh tomato, chop it up, fresh avocado, wonderful. I have neither of those things, doesn't matter. This is still a super tasty dish. Easy family nachos with proper tortilla chips and some sour cream. Smells amazing. My family are going to love it.